Okay. Anemone is not the enemy. It's pink. Is it the ocean? Oh. Doesn't look very happy, does he? No. Anemone is not the enemy by Anna McGregor. I'm so lonely. I hate being stuck here with the boring barnacles. High tide. Oh, look, new friends. Oh, no, it's an anemone. Why? Whatever you do, don't get too close. Hi, guys. What's happening out there? Don't ask. Mm -hmm. I bet you've seen some cool things, pirates. Mermaids? Kraken? Tell me everything. Hello? This is making me nervous. Low tide. Uh oh. As soon as the tide comes in, we're out of here. Sorry, I can't help it. I'm trying to make friends, not enemies. So why do I always sting everyone? I did it to the seahorse. I did it to the starfish. I even stung the cucumber. What a pickle that was. It's no wonder everyone avoids me. It's at high tide now. Mm -hmm. I'd rather take my chances out there. Good luck, clowny. Hi, nice hair. here but thanks this rock pool is great is it king tide uh oh an enemy i'm coming in but i'll there's a good octopus coming sting I didn't sting you. We're good together. Finally, I've got a friend. But I suppose you'll be going back to the big, exciting ocean. Nah, we've got a good thing going here. The ocean. Believe me. They're all going the other way. Out into the big ocean, out of the rock pool. And that's yeah, and some fun facts. Did you know that clownfish and sea anemones have a special relationship? Clownfish are immune to sea anemones, poisonous tentacles, and these provide the fish with protection from predators. In return, the clownfish clean sea anemones by eating algae and other food scraps off them. The scientific name for two species helping one another is Symbosis. We've got some information on the hermit crab. Hermit crabs don't grow their own protective shells like other crabs. Instead, they must use a discarded sea snail shell for protection from predators. As a hermit crab's body grows, it must upgrade to a larger shell. And fun fact number three, tides are the rise and fall of the ocean caused 